So this is our extremely popular 350 kilo inflatable trailer. No, it's okay. not inflatable. <laughs> it's still galvanised steel, but this is designed purposely for a soft bottom inflatable. Right, OK. So, so many people, they get confused with a, a rib and a sip. So you've got rib, which is a, a solid bottom, so fibreglass or aluminium. OK. This, this is for a sip. So they have to have bunks, OK? Yeah. You can't use rollers because the, the weight of the boat needs to be supported underneath the tubes. So here, for example, this is for, as I said, 3.8 metres, so a very popular inflator will is, for example, Homewave that we okay. supply uh, to the Honda next door. The reason it's super wide is because it will sit underneath the actual pontoony section on the yes, sides. Yes, the, the tubes. So the tubes would be sitting, again, it's all fully adjustable, again, multi-purpose, but this is suitable up, up to 3.8. So you've got, uh, the tubes would sit along here on the inside, which is the, where the strongest part of the boat is, where the seam meets, the tube meets the hull. We've also got designed here this rear transom support. So this supports the weight of the transom, thus supporting the weight of the engine, which allows you to have the engine on the back during transport. So with this one, because we've designed the trailer as low as possible, yeah. uh, it, it is suitable for launch and recovery. Right, um, okay, cool. And that's why it's got the eight inch. Yes, right. so that's why with, with this support at the back, you can have the engine on the back uh, whilst on the road and, and for launching. So got it. again, this uses um, our winch post, which has the handles as standard, yeah. again, to, to aid the trailer with boat on uh, at the slipway to, to launch it uh, one-handed.